Five days since the plane was brought down, evidence is slowly trickling through, building a picture of what happened to flight MH17. Its final moments are contained inside the flight recorders. They were recovered a day after the crash by rebels, but they've been taken away to an unknown location. Ukraine's security service released what they claim is a phone call between pro-Russian separatists, which shows Moscow's determination to seize the crucial data. I have a request for you. It is not my request. Our friends from high above are very much interested in the fate of the black boxes. I mean people from Moscow. But what do we know about how the plane was downed? This footage was released last week. Ukraine says it shows a Russian-made missile system close to the crash site, two hours before MH17 came down. And they claim this new video shows the same weapon being hurriedly taken back across the Russian border, its cargo covered up. Russia denies any involvement, but Western powers, including the US, are in no doubt who's to blame. Here's U.S. Secretary of State John Kerry on American TV. Now, there's a buildup of extraordinary circumstantial evidence. You know, I'm a former prosecutor. I've tried cases on cir circumstantial evidence. It's powerful here. So there's a, there's a stacking up of evidence here which Russia needs to help account for. The reports the wreckage shows signs of shrapnel damage. Experts say it may be consistent with an exploding warhead. But what is certain, there's going to be a long wait for any definitive answers.